Hello everyone and welcome back to Pokemon Ultra Sun Team Rainbow Rocket episode. Ooh. Alright. Time to do I wanna see if I can uh, find some more Pokemon in the Ultra Wormhole. Wormholes. Also liking my new setup for recording. I rearranged some of the furniture in here. It makes things a lot more comfier and a lot more easier to play rather than uh, having me to look at my teeth. also made a new book, apparently, or narrated one, two weeks ago, given the pandemic situation. And of course, it's as funny as the other one he narrated. Well, I, I really want a Mace Windy 
I I'm not kidding. Look, people are... Look, I know there are people wanting some more diversity in their movies. And I know there are some that kind of want them to slow down, but we can all agree that Mace Windu would satisfy a whole side. Why? Mace is played by Samuel L. Jackson, that's why. Fun fact, when they were making episode 2, he requested to have some purple light to or I think maybe up the one. And for Lucas is like, okay. He didn't know what, how he could represent that, so Oh, the purple light thing for me seems you represent also, not only use the light side, but also the dark. So it's amazing how how it also shapes the lore. Is that? It's gotta be one of the lake trees. As well. Bingo! Oh, if you notice, notice something? The legendary music, exactly from the game they first appeared in, or in their generation. This works. I'll try a quick ball, which is kind of more or less easier than that, so. Okay, right out catch. Let's try an ultra ball. And I'm out of Red Oasis in the store. Look, you don't need to carry on. Take it easy. Get in the box. Okay? Join us, we have Tuffy. That always works with the cookie. Okay, join us. We have Pi. Pi's gonna work.
Okay, now we're trying cake. There's no way. No way. It doesn't like cake. Like, everybody wants cake. Thank you for asking. Appreciate it. What are you doing? Okay. Alright, Lily. Do your magic. Thank you. Game. 
red, blue, and yellow. The first generation. Like, I, I got that reference. I like it. Okay. Hop quiz. Time to guess what's gonna happen. Is this grunt going to win? Is he going to go to the refrigerator and come right back? Or, or is he going to... Hmm, maybe lose to me. Between A, B, and C, so... Time to find out. If you... If you chose answer C, you are correct. Simon said. Yeah, that was pretty. Yeah, that was pretty darn easy. Why you will Oh, okay. Play that game, aren't we? Play it good. On whipping out the old smartphone. Alright, I'm check the footage. The flash turned on. Down, volume to the mic. Mm -hmm. Again. Okay, this time it'll work. What? I'm not enough ring? Okay. Alright, come check it out. Okay, green, yellow, red, oh that pose won't work, you little poser. Blue. 
do again. Ah! What do you gotta say about that? Oh, there's two of them now. Time to whip out the old smartphone again. Hope it got all of that. No, it this one. No. Simon Seth. You're like an absolute chump. Look, the poses are distracting. Yeah. 
from now on. This Arceus is from a Toys R Us again. Did we 
definitely hope they do make a comeback, but not in the midst of this pandemic. That would be a bad idea. This Katie's Poison is supposed to be making a comeback. That's good news for collectors like me, I guess. He's in his original design. It's a nice touch. Personally, I like his Omega Ruby design a bit better, but... I, I do like the original Ruby design as well. Again, these versions of these big bads come from Moral. For you weren't around to stop them. Or nobody could stop them. I'm liking this remix as well. Mighty Eno you know, is a dark type, so fairy type moves should be effective. And wouldn't you know, Arceus is holding the picture. Judgment move. The fairy type. And the pixie plate and the fancy one. And by boosting its power. Crowbat. Yeah. <laughs> 
Now, I don't know if this version of Maxi has access to Mega Evolution. Or not. Not taking any chances. I grow panic. Dialga shouldn't be able to withstand it. Given that it's also a steel type. But he's also a dragon type. And I have given him a contaminant orb, so... Bonus for power. Time to fight Groudon with Groudon. Hang on a second. We now return to your heavily anticipated battle. While I have yet to see the Hoopa movie, I do know there were two Groudons. One for the primal reverse form. From what I can remember. We'll probably go see that after this. I've got a lot to catch up on. Well then, goodbye and thank you for watching. All around.